Yo, 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 ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the vlog. Welcome back to the channel. I greatly appreciate you tuning in. Man, 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 I just saw a movie. And y'all may have seen it. Man, watch the intro. We'll talk about it in a second. Paris. Skirt, skirt. Skirt, skirt. Feel like C4 and a C8. Feel like C4 and a C8. Skirt, skirt. with all of you guys because I don't know why nobody told me that this movie right here was off the chain. Fire, fire, fire based off of a true story. I don't want to give the full premise of it, but when I tell you, I'm so upset that no one told me that this movie was so good. This is by far the best car movie I have ever seen. The only thing that would have made it better is if they would have used a Corvette. But I understand. There was a Corvette in it, but I really wish they would have used a C8 Corvette um, as the focus of the, of the movie. But nevertheless, it is still an excellent movie. When I tell you I could not sleep when I was watching this movie, uh, I actually turned it on and said, oh, I'm gonna doze off, and then the next morning, I was gonna get up and finish it. Once I started it, I had to finish it. And it was an excellent movie. So if you have not seen it, it's on Netflix right now, Gran Turismo. You will not be disappointed. If you have seen it, or if you watch it after watching this video, make sure you come back, leave me a comment down at the bottom so I can uh, you know, relate to you on some of the things you may have liked or disliked. But when I tell you an absolutely phenomenal movie, you will not be disappointed. Definitely go check it out. All right, a couple of videos ago, we also talked about a, a modification that I saw for CA Corvette convertibles. Uh, doesn't matter if you have a Stingray or the Z06. And when I tell you, I thought it was very, very neat, but it looks like now they're offering uh, for sale, like all the R&D is done. So I'm gonna put the prices down below so you can get an opportunity for those of you who are interested. But when I tell you, I like it. The only reason why I bought a coupe, and if you watched some of my videos before, is because you could see the engine in the back. Now that, that that's an option for the convertible for when the top is on, I think that's a phenomenal addition to the C8 Corvette convertible. And hey, if I end up going the next route, because I do like the E-Ray, um, I, like I said, I go back and forth. Today's economy got me a little nervous, but I will tell you, all of my stocks are up. I, I was very impressed. I checked my portfolio um, yesterday, and I was very impressed with how well everything is going. Don't know why that is. We all have our theories. I'm just nevertheless glad it's going up. But there are some other things that I want to purchase uh, maybe beforehand. But I don't know if that E-Ray come up, I may switch to a convertible, especially now that this option is available. If it's something that you're interested in, I'll drop the link down below, but definitely check it out. I think it is fly, especially for those of you that have um, C8 convertibles. Shout out the show, because him and I had that discussion a, a, a couple of years back uh, when I met him in Chicago. But if you something that you like definitely check it out i think it's a great addition to the ca convertible well now that we're in a discussion of body modifications for the c8 let me see if you guys would like this kit this is a kit that you can purchase i'm gonna try to gather all the information that i can put it down either here on the screen or in the comments below um, so you can maybe look into it, but let me know what you guys think about this kit. It may, I can't remember if it was something you can purchase or if this was just a render somebody was trying to come up with. Anyway, nevertheless, if it's something that you can purchase, I'll, purchase, I'll put it in a, down, oh, I can't get it out. If it's something that you guys are interested in purchasing, I'll make sure I put a link to it down in the bottom below. 
However, I would like to know if it's something that you guys like. If this body kit is available to add on to your C8 convertible and give it, I mean, your, your C8 period. And if it's something that you would be interested in doing, let me know down in the comments below. I just kind of want to see what everybody's, you know, mindset is thinking. Personally, I think it's okay. I like the uh, original look of the C8. But you know, some people may want a little something different because now there are a lot of them on the road. I've been seeing them more than uh, not. But nevertheless, you know, somebody might like the original and somebody might like this body modification. Y'all let me know. But that's gonna do it for this video. You know, I like to get in and out short and sweet. And please, 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 if you have not seen Gran Turismo, and I know I mentioned this a little while ago, but if you have not seen it, please go check out that movie. I think it's better than the Fast and the Furious uh, type movie, only because it's more realistic and it's based on a true story. So y'all, please go watch that if you haven't. And if you have, y'all drop some comments below so we can discuss back and forth on that movie. Cause man, I was, y'all, I'm gonna be broke. Cause I'm gonna end up going to the track. That movie is gonna make you, if you got a, a fast car, you're going to the track. I, we'll talk about it. I want to get out of here. I'll see y'all later. Thank y'all for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe down below. Appreciate y'all checking everything out. See you on the next one. Peace.